Taiwan is looking to Southeast Asia as a pipeline to fill the region's shortage of high-tech talent. The number of foreign students to the island has been growing, especially from Vietnam and Indonesia. Voice of America's Pei Hong Lim reports from Xinju. These students from Southeast Asia are not only learning Chinese in Taiwan, they are also getting technical skills training in their field of study. About an hour south of Taiwan's capital, Zhou Minggui from Vietnam is earning a master's degree at Mingxin University of Science and Technology. When I came to Taiwan, I heard that Taiwan is advanced in chemical and material fields. I really like these fields. Vietnamese students enrollment in Taiwan is growing. They are the largest group of foreign students in Taiwan and account for nearly a quarter of all international students at 27,000. There has also been an increase in the number for students from Indonesia. One of them is future civil engineer Happy Merita, who says it was earthquakes that brought her to Taiwan. I'm really interested to study here because Taiwan is known for its advanced construction method. Students like Happy and Zhong are the answer to Taiwan's talent shortage in tech, a problem that is made worse by the island's dropping birth rate. Taipei last year launched a plan to nearly triple the number of foreign students by 2030, retaining two-thirds for after-graduation jobs. The island has been looking to Southeast Asia as a pipeline for new talent. Foreign students are also drawn to the island. For Merita, the attraction is Taipei 101, the tallest building on the island. It's the famous tourism spot, but I could learn about how it's the construction method that used in the Taiwan 101, how the building is built. Especially how the building sways but stays strong during an earthquake. Many students are pairing their studies with internships in Taiwan with the hope that they will land a high-tech job here in the future. Pei Lim, VOA News, Xinzhu, Taiwan.